need a carbon tax. We need them to stop spraying. It's more complicated. It's not that if, if we can stop climate engineering, we still have great challenges to face. There's no question about that. We, I mean, so, so quite simply, uh, we don't need a carbon tax. We need them to stop spraying. It's more complicated. It's not that if, if we can stop climate engineering, we still have great challenges to face. There's no question about that. We, I mean, this so obviously, Greg Hunter asked Dane Wigington a great question. Do we need carbon taxes? Will that help? His answer was pretty alarming to me. Big red flag. Uh, he didn't squash the idea of the Rothschilds bringing in carbon taxes. Uh, he didn't squash the idea that the public is responsible for the global warming and the carbon up in the atmosphere. So this makes me think that this Dave Wigington, uh, even though he is by far the best speaker I've ever seen regarding the aerosol spraying and giving us the best information we have seen. I don't trust him. I mean, here he should have shot down the carbon tax initiative of the Rothschilds, of the, of the Illuminati, and he didn't do it. Which tells me, you know, the Hedgelian dialectic, the, the Hedgelian dialectic, the, uh, to bring about the synthesis. Well, the, synth the synthesis would be to tax us for carbon, blaming the carbon. Um, and uh, so the outcome would be the same, which makes me think that this guy is an agent for the establishment. Let me know what you think, guys. Bye-bye. There you go, and you thought it was an airplane.
when it was a bird that was responsible. Gotta be kidding me.